Welcome back to the Little Smokies in the Crockpot. They have cooked on high for two hours. You can two, two to three hours on a high if you need to. I'm low, um, about four or five. And remember, this is just grape jelly mixed with some chili sauce. Um, Heinz chili sauce, but I got the off brand, Walmart's off brand. So, uh, Betty's going to taste one and tell us what it tastes like. Now, remember, you can do meatballs with this sauce. Um, I've even put boneless, skinless chicken breast in the crock pot. Put it, make the sauce and put over it. Let it cook. Shred it and pull it apart and then serve it in on hamburger bun. Just sandwiches. It's good. Betty says it's good. Now, usually I, um, I just turn my crock pot to low, keep it warm during the party or whatever you're serving this as. Um, put a slotted spoon in there so uh, she's trying to show you the inside of it. Looks good. Um, put a slotted spoon in there so you can um, serve it and they won't get a lot of the sauce running all over the plate. Um, you can serve it as a main dish with some mashed potatoes or rice or butter noodles on the side. But I usually do it as an appetizer form with a d bunch of more appetizers. So there you have it. My quick and easy little Smokies in the crock pot. Um, we serve this at a red our wedding reception and at our household shower. And every time we have a cookout, family wants me to make this. You can to totally use barbecue sauce, but my favorite sauce is the grape jelly with mixed with the chili sauce. So I hope you try this recipe. Tell me what you think. See you in the next episode. It's Sarah. Bye, everybody.